Okay, here we are back again. Now we're going to go over how to stay motivated for the long haul. Now there's several ways that you can do this, but one of the first things, are you in this 21 day simple program by yourself or have you found a partner? At the very least, you want to find a walking partner, someone who can at least walk with you so that you do have a partner involved in this. Um, remember that your walking partner can't become a leisure partner. It can't be where you hold conversations. I mean, it's fine to have a conversation as long as you're keeping your heart rate up there and the pace is fast. So remember, when you do find a partner, it's not just to have conversation. It's to be able to just keep each other motivated. It's about accountability. Accountability becomes a very important aspect of this. And when you have a partner, a friend, or family, or neighbor that's, that's uh, exercising and walking with you, it makes it easier to get yourself out of bed, for one thing, and because you know that somebody's waiting for you. So it's accountability. Um, without that, it's very easy to say, uh, you know what, I'm going to do this later. I can get to it later. i got plenty of time today. A little bit later comes along and, and you know what, something came up, I, I'll do this um, after dinner tonight and then pretty soon it becomes tomorrow and then tomorrow becomes next week. So it becomes uh, a, a, a snowball after that. So make sure you get this, the, a partner to help you out for accountability. A fine example to that is um, my brother and I train together, okay? We're accountable to each other. Now, one of the things that, another thing to keep you motivated for the long haul is to try and schedule this. Like what I'm talking about with my brother and I, we train every day, five days a week at 11 o'clock. Doesn't fail. We don't change the time. We don't change the days. Everything happens at that time. So another part of the accountability is if you do have a partner, make sure that you're starting to set times to this. As you build your healthy lifestyle, it can't be random times. Just like Vern was going over, all of a sudden the next thing you know you're putting it off till the afternoon. Have a set time. You might take your walks in the evening, maybe at four o'clock you do your workouts, or maybe the whole thing happens at night. Maybe after dinner, it's 6.30 that you do your exercises and then 7 o'clock you're out for your walk. Remember, none of this is going to take you very long. It doesn't take a long time to build a healthy lifestyle. So you're trying to just get this generating where it becomes part of your life. Okay? Now, next, our next video, we're going to be talking about... What are we talking about, Jeff? Next, we're going to be talking about your metabolism is key. Is yours right? Okay, and we'll explain that next time. Have a great day.